Tonight, and only on Denver 7, we hear from the women who say Frontier Airlines discriminated against them during their pregnancies and while they were breastfeeding. Pilots and flight attendants filed a lawsuit today against the Denver-based airline. Denver 7's Ada Guajardo is in the studio tonight. They say they were forced to pump breast milk in unsanitary places if they were allowed to do it at all. Exactly. At least two mothers we spoke with say they were forced to use any closed space they could find at all to pump some of that breast milk, including small plane bathrooms. They say the long flights also led to hours of pain before they could pump breast milk, and one mother says she even got an infection. There is turbulence on Frontier Airline planes. On Tuesday, a group of pilots and flight attendants filed two separate lawsuits, claiming the company discriminated against them while pregnant, lacked policies, and safe spaces for mothers to pump breast milk. Can you say hi? I was given offices without locks, with windows to the outside. Randy, a pilot, says she even pumped in luggage closets. I can't tell you how many times I got walked in on it. Melissa, a flight attendant, says she felt forced to give up the possibility of breastfeeding her two children after being denied desk work. It was very much a don't ask, don't tell policy uh, situation. Um, there wasn't a policy. And when they did ask? Just crickets, just nobody. Um, would even get back to you. Galen Sherman with ACLU Women's Rights Project says the lawsuit is challenging a series of policies. Our clients were forced onto unpaid leave regardless of what their doctors said at a strict cutoff point of 32 weeks. Frontier Airlines denies the allegation saying, quote, strong policies in place in support of pregnant and lactating mothers. It goes on to say Frontier offers a number of accommodations for pregnant and lactating pilots and flight attendants within the bounds of protecting public safety, which is always our top priority. I mean, I guess I missed a memo. A claim these mothers say is a false narrative. It's 2019. Nobody should have to fight for that, this kind of equality. These mothers say their mission is to pave a better future for women who follow in their footsteps. Now, there is a difference between federal and state law here. Colorado law requires employers to provide a break and a private place for mothers to pump breast milk. Federal law is the same, but excludes flight attendants. That means lawsuits could shake, this lawsuit could shake things up. In the newsroom, Addie Guardo, Denver 7. Addie, thank you very much.